The following is an instructional video designed to provide new soldiers of the 3rd U.S. Infantry Regiment, the Old Guard, with an example of how to properly execute the non-commissioned officer portion of the exchange in the ceremonial certification testing process. Task. Conduct an exchange test for ceremonial certification. Condition. Given a candidate in ceremonial uniform with appropriate equipment, a ceremonially certified sponsor on a properly marked marching surface. Standard. The candidate must score a minimum of 80%, 11 out of 13 to receive a go. If a candidate scores below 80%, he or she will receive a no-go and have to retest at a later date. Each minor performance measure will be tested three times. To receive a go for a minor performance measure, the candidate must perform it correctly two of three times. The candidate must pass five of five major performance measures on all tests. Candidates that fail a major performance measure will immediately receive a no-go and have to retest at a later date. All performance measures must be conducted in accordance with TC 3-21.5 January 2012 and TOG Sword and Saber Certification Handbook. This is the grade sheet that will be used to assess each candidate's performance. The five major performance measures are Uniform, Ceremonial Composure, Previously Tested Events, Remaining in Step with the Beat, Ending within one candidate shoe length of the mark after halting behind the formation. The minor performance measures will be discussed throughout the remainder of the video. Candidate remains at the position of attention with tip up waiting for the simulated officer to march into position. Candidate goes to present on beat 22. Candidate lowers sword on beat 23. Candidate remains at present arms as the officer returns the salute. Candidate orders sword on beat 26. Candidate carries sword on beat 27. Candidate executes right face beginning on count 28 and ending on count 29. The candidate will pause on beat 30 before stepping off with their left foot on beat 31. The candidate takes four steps before pivoting with their left foot and conducting a right flank on beat 35. The candidate now takes seven steps before pivoting with their left foot and conducting another right flank on beat 43. The candidate marches seven steps, closing on the eighth. The grader will call staff halt to simulate the staff element on beat 47 and 49. The candidate executes a right face on beat 51, closing on beat 52 before lowering the sword after the last beat. The following list are some common errors to avoid. Getting off beat or out of step. Conducting present arms early. Taking too long on present arms to go down. This is a one count movement, not two like during standing manual. Not pausing on beat 30. Missing the tip down, either early or late. Upon completing this test, candidates will move to the shoot, which is part seven of this instructional series. For any questions on this event, please speak with your sponsor or your ceremonies and special events team.